بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم. We remind those who ascribe themselves to the Shia as to what is written in their book Al-Kafi. This book is considered to be the most authentic book uh, with uh, those who uh, consider themselves Shia. It is written there that the Imams, and this is in it, it is written that the Imma Yalamuna Mata Yamutun. The Imams know when they will die. وَأَنَّهُمْ لَا يَمُوتُونَ إِلَّا بِاخْتِيَارٍ مِّنْهُمْ And that they don't die except by choice, meaning from them. And this is in Usul Al-Kafi, Al-Killini, Volume 1, page 258. And also in the book Al-Fusul Al-Muhimma, Al-Hurin Amili, page 155. And also... Uh, you know of and this is addressing the Shia who may listen to this you know that the book Bihar al-Anwar by al-Majlisi reports a narration saying لم يكن إمام إلا مات مقتولا أو مسموما no imam except that he died by way of being killed or poisoned so therefore the question comes if the imam knows the unseen as Al-Killini had mentioned then he will know what will be presented to him from food and drink and if that is poisoned this would be known to him he would know the poison and he would act to avoid if he doesn't he will die committing suicide knowing that it's a poison and then taking it so he will kill himself and the Prophet ﷺ informed us that <coughs> the one who kills himself is in hellfire. Would the Shia really accept this for their Imams? Wouldn't you think when you blindly accept that they know when they will die and that they die by their choice and that they would know the unseen and how reconcile that with the Majlisi's statement no imam except that he died by being killed or poisoned We hope for you to contemplate and to break this chain of blind imitation for your own benefit so that you meet Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala free from these attachments meet him on pure Islam والحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم تسليما كثيرا